Hey fellas, top of the morning to you. It's uh, Thursday, August the 13th. It's 8 o'clock in the morning. I'm here at uh, Bastion Loves. I started my day around 1.30 or so, 2 o'clock, something like that this morning down from the Carolinas. Came here, took a shower, took my 30 minute break. Um, I'm going to pull up here and get some fuel, top off the tanks, I don't need much. Or I could just say hell with it and fill up tomorrow on the way back down in Indi uh, just north of Fort Wayne, Indiana. There's a Loves there we can top off the tanks at. Yep. So what's been going on? I know you guys are probably starting your day. I'm about all packed up. I'm pretty much packed up. It's just now when I get in the, back in the Carolinas um, Saturday, start packing up the car as far as buy stuff. I'll probably go to Walmart to get a couple things for the trip or f or to hell with it I could probably stop at a Walmart anywhere along the way if I want you know that'll give me an excuse to get out walk around a little bit if I want to yep while you know on the way up north so we'll be leaving out Sunday So when I get in Saturday and when I get everything done, I'll see what time I'll be shutting down and then I'll call the kids, you know, uh, after I shut down, get everything packed in the car, then I'll get some sleep because I want to try to leave about maybe 2 a.m. or so. Yep. That's what I'm that's what I'm gunning for anyway. Yeah. Well. I'll probably go into this loves here fill up my drink fill up some coffee and my thermos I needed it this morning you ever have one of them day or one of those nights well the reason why I'm doing these times up here to see usually I'd be leaving the Carolinas at 8 a.m. but they changed the schedule on me and uh well, I got in <laughs> when I got in yesterday they say oh by the way we want you to leave out at 2 a.m. I'm like fuck you know <laughs> yep yeah. And it's, I mean, shit, man, it, it must have been like 95 out yesterday. 
and sleeping in the hottest part of the day trying to sleep I got some sleep um, Because during the day in the summertime, I got these battery operated APUs. They're not fuel operated. I miss the fuel operated trucks. These are 2020 models. And some engineer at some desk somewhere that probably was never a truck driver. He comes up with the great idea of having a battery operated one. So, the more... You use the AC, you know, like uh, to try to cool down the truck because you're fighting the uh, frickin' sun outside in 100 degree weather, trying to sleep during the afternoon. So, so the more you crank it on cold and turn the fan up a little bit, you know, to try to keep it cool in here, well, when you do that, you drain the battery faster. I got to sleep probably about before 4 o'clock yesterday. And I set, I set my alarm to go off around 1 a.m. But I woke up just after 8 o'clock last night. I don't know. You know... It, I'd use the bathroom. Or, um, but I got up, I woke up, and my battery was about dead. And it, it went dead. So, so I've been up since 8 o'clock last night. So I've been up for about 12 hours. So yeah, I got an APU, but it sucks ass. And you know, if you're trying to sleep in the hottest hours of the day. Now at night, you know, if you're, if you're driving during the day and you shut down at night when the sun goes down, you don't have to keep it as cool. You know, you can mix the temperature kind of almost straight up in the middle, you know, or the blue and then the red kind of meat up top and then you can turn it just a little bit toward the blue and you don't have to have the fan on as much because it's night you know as the sun went down yep but other than that I mean it's it's an it's it's an all right truck there's some there's some um trucks I miss because the last truck was a uh, about, I think it was like a 2018 something and it and the APU it, an APU is basic it, it, what it is it's your AC and your heat well basically your AC and then you got a bunk heater that's your heat and it and it uh that runs so you don't have to idle the truck, all right? So if you had to idle the truck, you would burn a gallon an hour for like, you know, eight, 10 hours, however long you're, you want to sleep for. So it's like a gallon an hour if you're idling the truck. But if you're running the, the fuel operated APU, you're burning one gallon for the whole eight to ten hours. Yeah. So those are the, you know, and they they keep it nice and cool. There's they don't go dead like a battery one. And how and how it charges back up is when you're driving. While you're driving, it's charging the battery back up for the next night. Yeah, I don't think the engineers thought this shit through when they uh, 
came up with this bullshit APU, this battery operated one. But, so I couldn't wait for the sun to come up, so I, I feel a lot better now, now that the sun's up. Mama still get my coffee, because I, I still got about six hours, well I got six hours and 26 minutes left to drive with. So I'm going I'm to drive for another six hours, get up into Ohio good and shut down. Yep. Alright fellas, I'm not going to hold you up any longer, let you guys start your day, because I know i got to start mine. Well, I'm halfway through, i <laughs> I got to finish mine. Alright fellas, i got to get, i got shit to do, talk to you later, bye.